Thank you. For joining us. We move. Good evening, good night, good morning, good afternoon to some of you according to your location on the face of this planet Earth. We welcome you all to our today's live broadcast right here from our homeland Radio Biafra. Here in Biafra land, where I am broadcasting from, you are highly welcome. I remain the fearless IPB evangelist, Mazi Madapchi I am from Mundiabo. Mundiabo is in Anenri. Anenri is a local government in Ojiriba province, Biafra land. I am a homeland broadcaster, in case you don't know. Under IPO, Mundan Bikani is our leader. For your information, and the IPOB we are telling you about is under one central command, under one leadership, under one directorate, under one coordination all over the world. That's the IPOB we are telling you. Our address is Radio Biafra. That is our address. And if you want to see us, you want to meet us, Go to Radio Biafra. You will hear from us and we continue. Without wasting much of our time, we must have to pray. Our prayer remains giving glory, thanks to Chukwa Biama in the heavens, who have been doing it for us, even without weapon. Nareke then I wrote to Naraj Jaman and Ambulielu Narichi Sibu China de Rebi, or do you need to get Chinek and Debiafra, Chinek IPOB, Chinek and Namdekan, Chinek Ojuku? Chineke ndia ojuku. Chineke ESL. Narekele. Narotito. Narajijama. Nihi nebuchi. Nahagi. Chi. Kuku okike. Abia. Amara. Pro. Ime. Ihenile. We have prayed. Ise. 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 Thank you. We move. We will handle the first one. We are saying no to government-sponsored illegal sit-at-home using government agents in Finland to be killing our people and not even for Finland the can, as they always say, it is to perfect the agenda of the government because IPOB have done their best in marking Nigerian government with their propagandas of violence and criminality against IPOB by distancing ourselves as we know nothing about it and we have never known anything about criminality and they use their army to kill us we keep exposing them now, Nigerian government knew that the ESM was never provoked to leave the bushes so that uh, in order to come and confront them in our communities as they kept invading our communities, burning down houses, killing people, and they were expecting ESM to come inside the communities and defend our people as they told their agents to be shouting, Dear send our men, dear send our men, where is our men? These people are going to our community and in the same time the criminals are using it to defraud them by her shouting, Our men must be equipped, our land must be uh, defended. They are using it in two ways. And now ESM command did not order ESM to leave the bushes. Nigerian government, knowing that there is no way you can present the issue of ESN and full enhancements before the world. Due to full enhancement terrorists are the, is the, the world most, the world fought most deadliest terrorist organization. And that was the reason why ESN was launched. Now, See the game. If Nigerian government 
report to the world that ESN is fighting for an ESN terrorist, the world will give ESN the credit for fighting terrorists. Now, Nigerian government knew that it is unpresentable to any government in the world that you are against a fight against terrorist organization. It doesn't matter even if it is vigilante, even if it is village her, um, leaders that is fighting terrorism, they have the right. Right? Now, what they now disguise is that they want to present to the world that we are killing our people. They are running away from the duty of ESM. They cannot present it to the world. They cannot. Now, in their mathematics, through their recruits, when they try to break ESM by bringing them out so that the full army will overrun the bushes, IPOB and ESM command refused to bring them out of the bush because they were not launched to operate in the communities. Right? They now told one Eberimadia agent in Finland to say that he is in charge of ESM in the absence of an American, knowing too well that he has nothing to do with ESM. Rather, the criminal political talks that the governors took their contacts and handed over to the criminal government agent in Finland called Simon Eberima. He had been using them to claim to be ESN. People knew about Baby Bush. He's a criminal. He was a criminal. People knew about Double Lion. He was a criminal when he was alive. They were they, when they was alive. You know about Odumodu. You know about all of them small. You know about every one of these people. Tempo. The communities know them. They are criminals. These are the people they say they are ESN commanders. Knowing too well, at, um, to, um, fully well that their target is to blackmail ESN and carry on any criminal activities upon Namdekan and IPO. They will start shouting, we are in charge of ESN, we are in charge of ESN, we are in charge That's the government program to criminalize ESN because the duty of ESN cannot be presented in the world by Nigeria because they are doing legitimate work to fight terrorists. Now they now disguised and told the criminal in Finland to say he's in charge of ESN, whereby he started using the criminal politicians handed over their contacts to, to him, claiming their ESN, started killing our people, terrorizing our people, snatching cars, kidnapping people, collecting ransom, collecting bribes during various ceremonies in our community. Simon Ebrema is gone. That's what government sponsored. They now recruited well-known criminals by the state, by the... Everybody knows they are criminals. He claimed they are ESN. They started killing. You see them with the Siana. ESN does not have Siana. You see them with Jeep. ESN does not have Jeep. You see them with Helos. ESN does not have Helos. Because in the bushes where ESN was launched and they, they are, because that, they were launched in the bushes, not in school. And they are still in the bushes. There is no road, IPOP, um, constructed in the road, in the bushes, that motor will be going, um, the ESL will be driving vehicle. No. Every one of these people you are seeing, they are all criminals. You see them all in the communities. They can never show you a video where they are fighting Flammy Hessmen. They will only go and show you where they are torturing our people. What do they want to do? They want to present, they, they are doing the, the agenda of the government to have something to present to the world that ESN is not fighting terrorists, rather ESN is terrorizing our people. But the men ESN are in the bushes. These criminal gangs, when someone accepted the duty, now the governors and politicians also recruited their own personal criminals. Now, all the criminals also that have hope that Biafra is coming, because of IPOB agitation, they stop criminality in Biafra. Like we can tell, and we have pre-existing years ago when criminality stopped in Biafra land because IPOB agitation gave our people hope. Now, when our leader was kidnapped, they used someone to allow criminals to rise up. Now, the whole criminal now operates with the name of ESM because they have themselves, all those criminals, have known that Otumo is a criminal. So how come? A criminal in Finland is calling him ESN commander. So when he did that, 
All these criminals, they know themselves. If you go to prison, yeah, you know that criminals know themselves. They know them, they know you in the state. Even if you carry on any criminal action in the state or any place, they will tell you the gang that did it. Criminals will tell you the gang that did it. They will tell you the gang that can do such thing. Go to the prison, you will know. Right now, when the criminals, kidnappers, saw that their fellow criminals, that someone had been calling them ESN um, commanders, so they now say, okay, so criminals can act as ESN. All of them start acting as ESN. They start having gang group by group that Simon Ederima does not even have link to. Now, they started operating with the name of ESN. And we started exposing them. When you expose them, them they will go to their brothers and say that IPOB is calling the name of their men for their sense to kill them. These are not men. These are bandits in the communities that politicians handed over to Simon to be using and terrorizing our people, killing our people, collecting ransom, giving people bill, giving, creating levies, torturing people. They claim they are ESN. They are criminals recruited by politicians. Just took their contacts and handed over to Simon to use them and turn our people against their wish and their need, which is their fire isolation. When we started, our people shouted, they don't want to work. Now we can't represent their referendum for them and promise them that it and us are not work. And I probably have maintained this. That not and us are not work. Our leader said this thing will not be happening in our land. He said, we need to create the scenario of Yemen, the scenario of Syria, the scenario of Somalia in the northern part of the Dominable Republic of the Zoo. Now, all attempt is to blackmail ESM. Do you understand? Now, the politicians now want to destroy funding of ESM internationally. Right? Do you know what they did? They contacted all the people they sent to abroad, especially in USA, politicians in Biafra land, people they sent to abroad. They contacted them. Now, they started sending few dollars, euro and pounds to them. They now told Simon Eberima that you have to blackmail the image of ESN internationally. How? They told him, start raising funds with the name of ESN. Now, when you are raising fund with the name of ESN, be inciting violence during the raising fund by saying, our men must be equipped, our land must be uh, protected, any army we see, we kill. Do you understand? That's what they told him to be inciting, whereby the target is for the world as to take the report of Lai Mohammed that IPOB is raising fund to sponsor terrorists at home. Do you understand? So that is their international target earlier. When they are raising for, they will be shouting, our men, as if ESL have anything to do with communities or in communities. As if ESL have anything to do with sit at home. Our men must enforce it. Our men, that's what government told them. But the people that are listening and following them do not even know when the game is being played. But we IPOB, we will always explain it. It doesn't matter. It is so easy. We are telling you what we are doing and what we know very well. There are mega argument, a mega address. I know I no agree. It's not argument. You are a fool. You are stupid. You are envy. You are you are a fool. In the our argument. Argue the world. Present break arguments. That is what we are saying. Now, we are coming now, we'll come to the fake city and what is happening now. Even in Enugu also. But we are explaining. We are telling you what we are doing. Now, when they try to destroy IPOB financing of ESN internationally by raising funds and inciting violence, when we know that they are not raising it for ESN, they are raising the fund for criminals that
that politicians handed over their contact to Simon, which communities, states are aware that they are official criminals. Nobody have ever been angry. Nobody have ever mourned these people when they died. But he goes so people are still mourning him till tomorrow because he's a true son, a defender of the land, not killer of his people, not a criminal. Now, when the politicians contacted their agents in abroad, they told them, whenever Simon, we give him order to call for um, um, fundraising for ESM, then we will be, you see this money, you will be contributing it so that it will attract other Biafrans to join you and be contributing. This money they were contributing is to sponsor those political talks because they started demanding sponsor from the government. They, those governors that recruited them, therefore, now he goes for them. Okay, see, Basu, if I knew Guani and the Willio Biano and the Hanes and Ibu, those that recruited them and few politicians, other senators and co, that recruited them, they told them that we will not be sponsoring you direct, but indirectly. Now, how? You will be calling for fundraising. Call for fundraising. We will now send money to our agents in abroad. They will donate it. When they donate it, their friends, other people, gullible one, will be will be deceived, right, emotionally, to join them in donating. That's how they separated from Simon, giving him money direct, right? Because he started complaining to them for funding. That's why they said start raising funds. We'll be giving euro. You, you hear some of their agents, they say, we are giving 200 uh, euro, we are giving 400 pounds, uh, we are giving, donating 1,000 pounds, uh, we are donating uh, 50 pounds. These are money from Hopos or them. He gave it to their agents. They donated it. They told him to call for fundraising. That's how they ruled. All this thing fell. Now, Nigerian government landed up in telling them to destroy the only weapon that Nandekanu secured for the people of the East. Because the people of the East are peaceful. They are not terrorists, they don't have weapons. Now, whenever they rise up to show their, to lay their complaint through any kind of civil protest, Nigeria will rise up and start killing them. Now, we came up with this very method of sitting at home. The sit at home of IPOB is self-determination is um, civil disobedience because it is in line with in law due to it was it cannot be enforced and it none have been enforced ESM have no involvement in any sit at home because sit at home of IPOB have nothing to do with enforcement it is civility we campaign for it we don't we, we don't threaten people. It is a it is a weapon for the people of the East because they believe in killing us. So, if I had IPOB, had it been that we have weapons, what are we calling for sit at home for? We will go ahead with our weapons and they protest. If the government kills us, we will kill them back. But as they kept killing us, without any provocation, and we don't have any weapon to defend ourselves. Nambikano said, as a leader of IPOB, he discussed with leadership, they said, we are going to implement it at home, a very hard task, to make it to sink in the life of our people. We suffered to campaign for it at home. We suffered. It didn't come easy. We suffered because no threatening. You must convince our people to know the meaning. And that's what we did in 2017. We succeeded. Very easy, no threatening, no torture, nothing. Willingly, my case was locked. Federal government and all of them have investigated to know if IPOB had been bribing people to shut down my case. They discovered that it was willingly, nobody was bribed. Because in their polit political activities, they always bribe to gather um, crowd. Right? Now, now that they kidnapped them, they can they now told their, um, con their agent, agent, Simon Ebirma in Finland, federal government agent, that they contacted to be killing our people, to make sure that our people hate their, their, 
That's why Namdekan is staying in detention. When he is doing it, they will, they will say, okay, let us keep Namdekan and see if we can achieve what we need. If we can achieve what we need, let us use him and achieve it. Then, so that if IPOB is destroyed, now if the people reject Biafra, if you release him, he will not do it again. So, but these people don't know that they have failed. Then let us continue. When they kidnapped Namdika, they now told him, they don't even know that we are aware of what we choose. Self-determination. And we always guide our struggle, IPOB, jealousy. Now, do you know what they told me? To go with the gun, you know, they told him to be threatening, to be shouting, we are going to shut Ame Barak, we are going to do this. When he's saying this, government will be using it as a reason to drive the army more in our home, right? Now, government will now have chance to go and kill an army or somebody, a criminal, and put him army clothes and drop it, the person at the junction of any community, then the next time, the next one, you will see them drive with the armor car to kill that community. Because somebody created a way for them, telling them he's going to kill army, he's going to shoot army, which they told him to announce, so that they will now have the ground to go and get criminal or kill any Biafran, put him army uniform, just video it, and tell you that um, IPOB has killed army. That's all. The next one, you will see it, that they will invade that community. That's what they have been using him to do. And that one, they use all these things to give to global tourism um, for IEP, right? Um, institute, is it uh, economic what? What? That gave the Global Terrorism Index Report, I couldn't remember their, their full name, IEP. Then, they tag us, they put us in the list of terrorist organization with all the actions of Simon Eber, all the actions of him and his criminal gang that the politicians handed over to him to be controlling and be using them and kill our people. They use it and present against them the can. None of these people that caused those mayhem was able to rise up and defend Namdekan because when you see that they put IPOB in the list of terrorist group, you know that is in Namdekan, automatically you are a fool for calling his release because no government will free a terrorist leader, right? Now, IPOB, all of them touched, knowing that they are the one who committed it against Namdekan, but they told this for free Namdekan, but they were trying to jail Namdekan, right? Now, when we fought in a legal way, these people now understood. They removed the name of IPOB. None of these people that committed it because no IPOB killed anybody. They called us cowards because we refused to kill our people. They called us cowards. They say we are compromised. They say we collected money because we refused to set our land ablaze. We refused to deviate from civility. We refused to deviate from self-determination. We refused to go into violence instead of continuing in our peaceful conduct. They called us coward. They called us compromise. They called every. They started killing our people. They say if they kill our people, Namikano will be free. They never attack Nigeria government. They keep killing our people. They say you sit at home. When the name of IPOB was put there, you ca they can never bring the evidence and say no. It was uh, that this is a tweet we tweeted and say no. It was not committed by IPOB. It was committed by us, autopilot. Nobody said it. They touch, knowing that IPOB did not commit it. All those things was all their crime they committed on Monday. Federal government used it and submitted against IPOB. If they love Namikan, when they saw that their crime have put the IPOB that Namikan leads into the list of terrorist organization, why did they not fight? They have keep on killing our people, knowing that what they did was the reason why Nigeria has ground to report. If not that IPOB follow the way and they address the issue and our name was removed, what do you, what will you be asking for now? Nigeria would have been taking those that thing to any government that say free Namikan, they will present to them that Namikan, that the IPOB is leading, he is listed in the terrorist group, in the terrorist list. And that government will succumb and go back. This 
these are things we told our people that they want to use them and use your love on Namdekano. Then, if they use your love, they will turn you against Namdekano. Unknowingly to you, you will think you are doing it for him. But you are caging him because you did not go and study this thing. Nobody studied it. So you try to claim that you know when you don't even know. There is no cause you call Biafra in this school. Why is it that IPOB will be telling you this is the path we choose? You don't involve in this path. If you are involved in it, don't mention the name of Namkan and IPOB because it is it will affect what they believe in. You say no, leave him to do his own. Can't you do your own without mentioning IPOB and the Namkan? Then so that whatever you committed, the government will report it that you committed it. But you, because you are in it, you are in it with the agenda, federal government agenda, you are in the contract. If you are killing, you will call the name of Namdekano. You will point the gun at the people. You say free Namdekano. You will shoot Okada man. You say free Namdekano. You will scatter people's groups in the name of Sitatum. You say Sita, free Namdekano. Tell me a criminal that have ever go with ID card and address. So you will be terrorizing people, you will be mentioning Namdekano because you are agent to criminalize the name of Namdekano and IPOB. Why, why is it that you don't do things without mentioning Namdekano? Because you cannot do it to affect Namdekano. All their agenda, all their actions is to hold Namdekano down. Can anybody take Monday statue? to UN or EU and say we have uh, conducted Monday sit at home. So we want you to free Namdekan based on Monday sit. Can anybody do it? Can you present it? It is unpresentable. Now we continue. We are talking about fake sit at home. Because IPOB sit at home still remains legit legit it is in existence that is why our people should know how they address it at home sit at home have not been abolished we are separating the government sponsored terrorism um terrorists and the um illegal force at home they call sit at home because they are target is to tag all the crime they committed on IPOB because IPOB initiated sit at home. They do not have sit at home. They did not initiate it. They knew it's IPOB that did it. And the, anything they commit in the name of sit at home, that federal government will try to convince the world that is IPOB. That's why they told them to be calling for it and be using it to kill our people. You cannot be fighting for freedom, you'll be killing our people. It is unacceptable. Right? This is working for the government. But when they want to deceive you, they call the name of Namdekan so that you they will get your sympathy. You will say, hey, he's fighting for free Namdekan because you are a fool. You are an idiot. Knowing that the person you shoot or the person that they killed and you supported, you are not more important than that person. If you know the importance of blood of Biafras, you stop killing them. Some of you idiots refer this very time to that of Amazonia. Ambazonia is just practicing, just trying to do what we saw, 1967. Because they can, if you, if the world conspires, they conspired against us on them, they will vanish now. Do you know what came on us? So they are, they are not seeing their own. But ignorantly, you will see some fools, they will tell you do like Ambazonia, but we have done our own. We are now addressing the issues with um, self-determination. We are now addressing the issues. All the efforts of our fathers is the 7 to 70. We are now taking it to the world. Because they called us rebels. So, if you want to fight for freedom, you start with the terrorism or violence. The world will now have no doubt on the rebel that they called our fathers. But IPOB came with self-determination. First of all, to clear the faces of our fathers, to clear the image of our fathers, to prove to the world that Nigeria has been the problem, that our fathers are not terrorists, our fathers are not rebels. And with our endurance and our civil manner, we have been proving our fathers right. And the faces of our fathers 
we had clearly it with our truth. Had we started with God initially, they would tell them that this is how Ojuku started. He don't, he is not patient. He don't listen. He don't that's the allegation they gave him. But we have been patient since to prove Ojuku right, to prove Nzog right, to prove FM right, to prove Mwawa right, because they were here and they brought war in our home. The same thing is happening. Why must somebody be fueling it so that they will massacre us? Our leader call it premature war. They want to force us into a premature war. And now they are using people. They're trying to use governors to open doors for terrorist army and police to come and kill us in order to provoke us. In all these killings, we never go to war. Because if we have gone, we cannot give press release to address the government. Are we foolish? We will go to the governor with our gun. If we have gone, we cannot come and be telling you those that uh, gave order for Python dance or Hanese. What are we calling their name for? Organizer and governors. We will go after them one by one. But we don't have gun. We don't have weapon. And we are not into violence. And our method, not if our what we choose is self-determination. Such thing cannot be involved. We don't kill. We don't kill any politician. We don't kill. We don't kill. We expose our enemies. We expose them. And we keep marking them with the truth. That is our method. And that is our weapon. We mark them out. Shamelessly, they will start hiding. They will not be even bold enough to raise up their weapon. That is how we expose enemy. We expose them in the market. We expose them in the field. We expose them on the road. We always expose them so that they will not have a hiding place. This has been our method. Go and study it. Go and study it. It is our method. Now, there is one of my posts. Let me read it. I want to read it. One of my posts. Is it this morning or what? I want to read it. Let us just see what is there if they can allow me. Let me see. Let me just see. Let me see. Okay. Maybe it is not here. Not here. It's not here. We move. I wish I can see it now and read it. Okay, let me see it. No, I've seen it now. Let me read. There is no enforcement in civility. ESM has no business with any seat at home, which is civility. And the civility cannot be enforced. It's a very simple message. Civility cannot be enforced. ESN does not involve in civility. Do you now understand? That's why they told their criminal agent to say that our men will enforce it to involve ESN. So that Nigeria will have a very um, dark uh, or black color to present to the world on behalf of ESN, right? Which we know that ESN cannot be involved in the terrorism of our people. Rather, they came to fight terrorists that government sponsored against our people using Fulani headsmen in these guys as Katoriaras, terrorists we knew. And they have been killing us, and that's why ESN was launched. It was not launched to enforce our people. ESN was not launched to threaten market or business people. ESN was not launched to go and enforce market to shut down. ESN was not launched to go and destroy upper market. ESN was not launched to go and collect ransom from people that are having burial ceremony. ESN was not launched to go into cast snatching. ESN was not launched to go and kidnap and collect ransom and tell them we are not supporting Biafra. ESN was not launched to call people on phone and tell them to support ESN. No. ESN can never be involved in these things I have mentioned. None. Because they are suffering in the bushes. They knew their duty and they have duty posts. They were not launched to operate anywhere. If we want to fight our enemies and we want to fight in the communities, there will be nothing like any government house. There will be nothing like police stations. You will fight army barracks not killing our people in the markets because our leader promised that I and Azra law.
Now, when government kidnap our leader, they now call Simon and Eber, their agent, to be obtaining those things against us. Now, you have forgotten that IPOB have endured so many massive killings, which would have pushed us into violence. But we remain in self-determination because it will save our land. If we pick up arms, it will destroy our land. The enemy will not even go after IPOB. They will go in the communities, destroy our communities, burn down our markets, destroy it, put fear in us, set checking point before our communities or at the gate of the markets. Then they are, it is a way for them to come and conquer you. By then you will not be feeling free again. So these people are the people they are using. Now, when IPOB started, we have sit at home 2017, no enforcement, there was no ESM. 2018, no enforcement, there was no ESM. 2019, no enforcement, there was no ESM. 2020, no enforcement, there was ESM in December, right? That it held on June, on May. Now, 2021, there was ESM and there was no enforcement on the 31st of May, 2021, because it didn't held on the 30th May. It was 31st, because that day was on Sunday. So we shifted it to Monday. 31st, there was no enforcement. Your friends willingly obeyed it. Right? Now, we ask you, why is it that when Nambikano was kidnapped, then one of their agents in America, they call Nelly of Fable, as federal government program it and contracted them. Then Nelly of Fable now told China Samuel to abandon DOS. That's the plan of the enemy. So that they know that that is the powerhouse of Nambikano. So they want to take the mind of the people away from them. He said, they, she said to Mazishin Asamuru, abandon the US. Let us use the name of ESN and release our leader. I will bring someone ever to you. He will help you. Do you understand? Now, they come back again. They said, if it is finance, we will finance you. Gina Samuru said, no, that's how he became an enemy. Now, somebody that is fighting under self-determination, Nigeria kidnapped him in Kenya, right? And they rushed after they failed to give him. They presented to the world that Namdi Kano should defend himself in court. As smart as Nigeria is upon their foolishness in kidnapping Namdi Kano, they now try to be smart. smart. Knowing that, when they present court, thinking that if they present court, now that they will do, they will follow through um, the court proceedings to provoke us. They will use it and provoke us. When they provoke us, we will not deviate from self-determination, which we knew that had they not become being in armed struggle, they will not tell the world he will defend himself in court. They will not even tell us, let us know the particular detention facility where he is. But they presented to the world first that he will defend himself in court, proving that Namdekano is in line and he maintains self-determination. Nigeria proved him right. Now, they knew they cannot win him. The best thing is to play a game and force us into violence. Because now, China Samuru refused to use the name of ESN to fight for Namdekano because ESN have no business on free Namdekano. These are things I have told our people. In several times, I will continue to repeat it. ESN is not the Afra Army. ESN have no business on Free Namikan. If ESN have business with Free Namikan, they would have Namikan wouldn't have called Ozukome. They would have they wouldn't have lawyer uh, been any lawyer representing Namikan. ESN would have gone to DSS and free him. ESN cannot be killing our people. You know we know that they are using. Nigerian agent to kill our people. Now, ESN cannot be killing our people and tell you suffering Namdi Kano. It is a lie. ESN was launched to save our people. So, these people killing our people are government agents. Government, um, uh, what is it called? Government political talks, right? Criminal gang. They handed over to Simon to be given order for Sitatum so that these government agents will be killing our people. In order to use it against Namdekano, who have already been discharged and acquitted.
only to have something they will be presenting to the international community that are demanding for freedom they can to be presenting it to them and tell them look at what they are doing look at what they are doing they are killing nigerian citizens they are killing nigeria that's what they have been presenting and you can never see this criminal that are doing it and to debunk it and say no IGOB did not do it it is not a pilot it is simon no if you now expose their character they will tell you it's not simon these are what they are doing. They never do anything and take the glory. But they expected IPOB to take the glory of criminality. And we said no. They called us cowardice. Now, they have never said we are in charge of, we did this. We killed the pregnant woman. We are the one who was shooting, who shot a kind of man in a, um, on Isheke. They never they take responsibility. Do you understand? But if they hear that they say it's IPOB, they will be rejoicing. Now tell me, how can you do good things? They give, they give the glory to IPOB and you will be quiet. Because you know it is not good thing. It is not something honorable. You committed it so that it will be used against IPOB. We, if you are genuine, you are doing right thing. Media cannot try to give IPOB the glory of your criminality and you will be quiet. When you see that IPOB is rejecting it. Now, if you do something, you say it is effective. And they call the name of IPOB. And IPOB rejects such glory. Why can't you claim it? But all of you always dodge. Do you understand? You see the game. The game is, do everything you can do. After all, Nabucan is in our custody. Do it. We will use it against him. And that's what someone is doing. That's why, if he give order, whether it work or not, government will tell him to give another order. They don't know whether you... Because he's not in charge of his, himself. He's been under control. Hence, you have sold out. You are under control of the government. You have no power. You become useless before the government. They will control you anytime. They will send you ugly messages against your people. And they will tell you what to use in order to, deceive, to convince your people. And this time around, they will use free the country to convince you while they are burning down your communities, putting your land on fire. If they send two people, they will come with Isiana. They will shoot gun in your junction. They will run away. Army will come to your community and kill you. Do you understand the game? Now, the people, none of them would have told you that earlier, earlier, that China is the one who should abandon DOS. Let them use the name of ESN to fight for free the country. I ask you, Please, can ESL free Nam I'm asking, is ESL their friend? I mean, now, should ESL be involved in free Nam The answer is no. Because Nam is fighting for Biafra under self determination. If he is into armed struggle, we will have no reason to go for court or uh, to call for lawyer. And Nigeria will not tell the world he will defend himself in court. Because Cameroon is not taking Ambazonian Ambazoni leader to any court. Nobody knows where he is. Because they are into arm. Do you now see the difference? Now, if ESN say they are involved in Finland, and the can, Osokome cannot accept to be your lawyer. Now, had IPOB deviated and said that they have gone into violence, there is no lawyer that can be bold to defend an American. One, if you see how boldness Osokobe is, I think you can be seeing how bold Barista Jofo is when they are speaking to the government. Do you know the reason? IPOB. Why? IPOB maintains self-determination. Now, when a Jofo was going to Professor Mike Ozukomi, do you know why he didn't accept the, of the very job earlier? Because he was busy. He studied the agenda of the government against Namdekan. Now, Professor Mike Ozukomi, son, was busy studying the activities of IPOB. He now discovered that IPOB is separating criminality. That IPOB is also fighting criminality. And that IPOB is also making sure that free criminality
cannot be fixed to the name of Fernandican. And the IPOB is also maintaining self-determination. That's when Uzukome was satisfied. That's why you can see him boldly telling you that what the Namdekan is doing is right. Do you understand? Because the IPOB Namdekan release have never deviated. Had we deviated, we will, we will weaken the lawyers. Our attitude can weaken the lawyers. Are you aware? But our, as we maintain peaceful conduct, we give the lawyers strength. We give them boldness. We give them strong leg to stand before the enemies. They speak with boldness. They don't care. If you like it, then because IPOB have proof that they cannot right. We maintain self-determination. Any lawyer can join our case to defend Kano if he accepted. Do you know why? IPOB refused to be engaged in criminality. Even federal government, when they knew that China someone refused to leave the um, DOS, they told someone ever that in your favor told China someone that he will bring someone ever to help him. And someone will be doing the media. Then China someone will be using ESN. Then he asked these criminals, where will the ESN go? Is it to DSS to free Namdikano? These are foolish idiots. Now, do you now see the now government now told someone ever to say that the struggle has entered autopilot because IPOB refused to do any harm. So their target is for IPOB to do any harm. So that if the case of Namdekan comes up in court, they will be coming to court with evidences and automatically it will weaken the barristers. Do you know why? Let me give you a small reason. Small some example. In your community, let me just say or uh, that you are uh, you was reported in police for a particular offense and your people are going for that very matter trying to free you or to settle the matter or free you from the matter then if they see you they know what they are suffering to remove your name from that very allegation if they see you again when the matter have not ended where you are even trying to fight or you are raising voices or you you are you are being provoked by somebody what do you think your people will say they will tell you now open with you they said to the big game they said to the big can they book my own image they are going to use game they are going to book it again it has to be a basic job in can they book it again in a team at the end and then man he may be a good day they might not see him again. Oh no, that means they will tell the report or show him with evidence. Okay, man, he can go to the defending. There are evidence I get within a court. Get him no matter sign he will. Get him na he will get to go to him. That your client in the defending is not a matter of determination. And we are get present he will to him. But I P O B refused to put our lawyers and American lawyers into shame. We maintained our position. Even as the federal government decided try to they do everything, they came up with blackmail, they came up with propaganda, they came up, we stood our ground because we know it is clearing road for our lawyers. Even to visit the Namikan in DSS, there are things IPOB will commit had we deviated from our peaceful um, conduct. If we commit it, DSS will use it as a grant. They will not allow the lawyers. Had they succeeded in putting IPOB in the list of terrorist organizations as they tried earlier, but IPOB defeated them, it was really removed in the Global Terrorism Index list. Had it been that in our was is still there, they will not be allowing the lawyers to see him as usual. They will tell him that the American is a terrorist that is in the list. They will tell the lawyers, the SS will tell them. Do you understand? This visitation, both those that are attacking us. Their visitation to DSS is because Namdekan told us to continue in our way, which we have never deviated. Had we go into arms, you that used to go to DSS and gossip, you will not have that chance. That door would have been closed. Those chances would have been closed. But because we maintain it, doors are still open and more doors are being created. People don't even know what we are facing in the case of Fernand de Khan. Let me tell you. For IPOB refuser to go into armed struggle is a very serious problem for Nigeria. A serious problem to them. 
you cannot win this case. Now, see, the bomb, the killings, the missiles, they are supposed to be carried on in our place in the name of war. They turn it around. They are now using it against him with deceptive power. This refusal to cut order or disobedience to cut order they are using on Namdekano are bombs, missiles they would have been throwing in our land had we been in arms trouble. They would throw chemical weapon in Enu. They would tell you that IPOB was a manufacturing chemical weapon and it exploded. Nobody can defend it. If IPOB try, that one has gone. People have died in Enu. This is a war. They wanted IPOB to follow them. A war that things can be done and nobody will agree he did it. Namikano said no. IPOB said no. We will fight this war in the open. And that is why we maintain self-determination. We go to court. We take our matters to international communities. That is fighting in the open. If we engage in armed struggle, they will still use the BBC. They will still use the Britain. They will buy over the world media to cover up what they are doing in our land. Now they will turn it and say that IPOB did it. Even as they are doing now, they will kill Nigerian army personnel, police. They will report it to international community. I'm sorry, Nigerian police, army police and the personnel, they will kill Biafra. Right? They will, Nigeria will take it and report it to international community that IPOB killed them. But is the army that killed them? The army killed. Now, this, uh, the, the refuse to give them the kind of food. This should have been a bomb. In one state, in other, um, in the in the in the east, right? But uh, we did not give them such chance. So they are using it on them and they can. But we love the battle because it is in the open. The world are watching. But if you are here doing it with them, they will be killing you. They will be hiding it. Have you ever seen army agree that they killed you? If the news go high too much, they will tell you it's IPOB terrorist. Do you understand? They will kill you. But we refuse to fall into their dance. So that they will keep dancing the music we are playing. We are fighting in the open. That's where Namdekano dragged them to. He dragged them to that place, open fights, in the face of the world. That's why you see us going to government in the world. That is the battle. That's what Namikano want to do to them. If you engage in gun battle with them, they will hide. They will do you something they will deny. But this very court proceeding, they can't deny any ruling that will secure. It was in the open. Do you now see the battle we gave to them? They cannot fight it. They want, to, they want us to go into violence. That's why they are using their agent. Now, when they saw that IPOB refused to go into Armstrong, they told the Bilma to use Monday Sit at home and be killing a people. And that's what they started reporting in Namdekan. Today, now, when we defeated those things, they could not be able to use it against Namdekan as amendment grant of appeal in Supreme Court. Now, they did not also not um, succeed in no election, as they told someone ever to call for no election. So that IPOB will be blamed because their name will not be called. He's not leading anybody. He's just Simon Eberima. Nandikan is leading IPOB. The world government have nothing to do with an individual in the issue of freedom fighting. That's why the language of their force at home is Simon Embassy at home. It has no weight. You know, people don't have sense. The voice of an individual in your village cannot be compared with the voices of the community as a whole. If they go to protest before the traditional ruler, somebody address the traditional ruler, it is the villagers that are saying. That's why IPOB have weight. That's why Nigeria want to destroy IPOB. You cannot present the name of an individual. Now, what they used to say is someone ever sit at home, call it the name of his group. Then the sit at home have no weight. Therefore, it will be enforced. But you can never hear Namdekano sit at home. What you will hear is IPOB sit at home. IPOB is a people. Do you now see the difference? Do you now see why federal government told them to be calling for it? He is not leading anybody. They tried to use IPOB. We separated them. They said that autopilot, that's when they died. 
the agent that died. Now, we now expose the name autopilot as a foolish as in the name is. They say we'll be using IQB. We now hit them again. They ran away. They said they declare government in Einstein. Now you ask yourself, which what is the name of the group that declare government in Einstein? Because it must be a group or organization. What is the name? Is it autopilot? No. Simon Eba declare government in Einstein. Do you now see how it sounds? It's not even a people. You know, the people went to school, though I didn't go to school, that I have sense from God. I want to go to common sense. I want to go to me. Common one from God. I want to go to me. Now, the voice is so funny, the voice is so good, I will hear the same. The voice of IPOB is the voice of the people. That's why Mamikano does not sign memo. He knows something. He allowed the head of the state of state to sign a memo of his own announcement on Radio Bia. Announcement of Namdekano that the head of the state of state will sign the memo because it is the voice of the people. We only channel our voices through him. You see where he refer you? That is the people that decided, not him. He don't do individual. Now, if individual can work, why is it that Namdekano did not start agitating for Biafra and say, Biafra, we are doing Biafra. No, he said, join IPOB. You must have a movement group or an organization you are leading to fight for freedom. There is no freedom fighter, freedom fighter that has no name of his group, movement or organization. Do you understand? You must have it. Now, do you see the mess they are into? Someone ever sit at home and someone ever government in Einstein. It is an individual. He's, he's listening. He will now come up with a game. You know, I'm a TNS. I am um, a TNS. I put him in trouble. Right? Now, that is very language. Too low. Shouting is not the problem. What is your foundation? Who are you taking to any government? Is it you? Even as Sinamikano is leading IPOB, Osibajo told the BBC that he is only Namikano and his family doing it. Ask yourself, why do they go to that narrative? Because the world will not listen to you if you are doing something, freedom fighting with only your family. Now Namikano now gave order that I all wrote the list of Farouk and the IPOB family members came to Afaruku, and the white people now saw that he's not doing it with his family. Now, do you now see the game there, that you must present your people, the people you are leading? Now they can't knew it. So you have to give order for IPOB to come. He cannot say, I'm leading the Afra people, don't you see them? He want to present them. And he gave order, IPOB came. And the world saw that he's not doing it alone. Now, IPOB used to call for sit at home, not, not on Namdekan. It have weight. Do you understand? Now, Simon Eba have no group is meeting. And by the way, government told him to say I'm in charge of IPOB, we, we push him out. He said I'm in charge of ESL, we push him out. He's leading criminal. We push him from attaching that his criminality to that because he's not IPOB family member at all. He came through um, Caroline Rich and the mother to, and the canon and their conspirator. Do you understand? Now, thank you. You see what we have been fighting. We fought in the election. It was a trap against IPOB. They used Simon. No election. No election. No election. Ask yourself, after shouting that, IPOB played civility. And when we played it, ask yourself, why did he not go to polling unit and start killing people? The target was had our people stay at home. And there was no nation in Biafra land. 
Fulani will bring out their political criminals to start destroying something in Biafalan and say is IPOB doing. They are making sure that they enforce it at home so that there will be no election. Now, after this thing, no, if you talk about Namdekano in the East, because they will tell you you are the one who made people to be not to be president. If you talk about Namdekano, they will kill you in your face. That was the game. They wanted to use someone to play. So that the whole Nigeria will be against Namdekano, even those that love him. If you call his name, they will say he's the one who stopped Peter B. Peter B is supposed to free him, but he stopped Peter B from becoming president. He used his IPOB sit at home to stop Peter B. That's what they will not call Simon ever because he's not you leading a group. That's why after they told him to stop Ibos from coming back from Lagos, as IPOB have as our people have bought the idea of coming back home, they told him to call for seven days. And call it free Nam Dekan. Seven days is to stop our people that are coming back home to wait. So that the story will be there is insecurity in the East. And on this, Nigeria sponsored their media. They started discussing insecurity in the East. They refused to discuss insecurity in the North. So they want to put fear in our people to stop our people. Now, when they now saw that it did not go fine. They now told Simon Ebenema to call for two weeks again, and these are federal government doing it. They just use him as a spokesperson because he will call the name of Biafra and call on Namdekan. If not, federal government will be saying this by themselves. But they use somebody that can be calling Namdekan and Biafra. So you will dance into their tune without knowing that they are using him to destroy you. They want to frustrate you. They want to make your language to say, no, nah, I have to say no Biafra. I have to say no, nah, eh. Yes, eh, I no. Biafra, I have say no. Do you understand? Now, that's what they targeted. You have seen them run out of patience. Right? We say no to sit at home in Enugu. This is what they wanted them to say against ESN and IPOB. We say no to IPOB. Do you understand? We say no to ESN. This was the initial protest that was planned. Now, they now raise it up with Sitatum. Because it is in their plan to destroy IPOB Sitatum. They are using Simon. Now, you see them. So, they wanted to go there. So, we don't want Sitatum. Without knowing that the IPOB Sitatum is legit. Anytime the order comes, it stands. Our God is in charge. We don't make mouth. We don't threaten. Our God gave it to us. He always just use us to announce it on Radio Biafra. That's the end. He will do the rest. Even with that campaign, we have been we have never been convinced that our campaign was the one who made the sit at home of IPOB always successful. We know it's our God because Sunam Kanu told us that every anything we mention here on Radio Biafra will be approved by heaven. But these people have not such such grace. So they used them for sit at home. And it's a government agenda. Because set a term of IPOB is civility. It can never be enforced. Civility of no business with enforcement. Civil servants have no business with the army in their protest. Army cannot need civil servants in protest. Civil servants are civilians. So they will only lead themselves. Now, they handed over gun to Simon Eber. They told him to be hooking on sit at home. Ask yourself, if he is not working for the government, why is he, why can't he use his gun and go after the government? He saw somebody that declared armed struggle. He's there threatening if I know about, he would he would threaten governor, he would threaten this. Use your gun and can't challenge him. No. At the end, he will go and behold IPOB sit at home. Because that is the agenda of the government. Destroy that weapon. They told him to use it against our people. Use it and frustrate them because we are keeping in Namdekano. Use the name of Namdekano. Use free Namdekano as a slogan. To use this weapon against the people so that they will reject it. And he can make a smoke. It's your idea with arguments. Don't, I will see you are a fool. You are envy because you were contracted. If you know what you are doing, you argue me. Oh, here can now. May I argue in a comment, huh? Eh, I can't have an IPOB. You go to 
Me don't die, any. Okay, man. I am now. Okay, man. I have come now. Feed on fat in Anna, go, my go. I said, I'm a catalog, maybe do feed on fat. That is why you can't look at that shift on like you be, because same with decision. I will give more, I will give more somebody, I never have a double standard. God, John, dear mom. I don't do double standard. You know what I give away, I can make it. Man, I want if. Oh, that I should be. I want double standard, I don't have a member. In the end, I have a IPOB, I have a IPOB meeting, I have a IPOB meeting. Can you ever hear me? Hey, being a support cleaner. They are not told they are unit meeting, but they are unit meeting. Do you not see you are a fool? Can you ever hear me? They are not a unit also already. So, the autopilot. Because they don't have name. You never claim to be autopilot. In the life you'll be meeting, Nadia Fallon, I jog. I see. They only have a autopilot. They have a weapon name, they have a long name. They are not shaking. I am not going to information. I am not going to give you 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 information. I am not going he can have been on a meeting as it. Now, only water pile or give me. He believe in a game because only making him Even in a man, your job. You knew you cannot be proud of it. In what time they shall be proud. In a rhythm, there is a IPOB one family. In a year. I am not sure one day keep it at autopilot. They were all among us, Chaga and Yabahin, and it was why he knew we na grand units of family meeting like you. A boy is Chaga Chagin, even if it's a gun now, so so. Do you understand? So, if you see them calling for sit at home, I'm telling you, yes, I will enforce it. They are not yes. These are criminals, politicians handed over to Simon and Bill to be using to kill our people. Simon and his gang are murderers. Now, market leaders, they they promote this government sponsored terror, um, terrorism, which they call it at home. It is federal government sponsored terrorism. But you know, the police, the police, our a criminal, he's representing criminal. He's a murderer. Sympathizers, I don't allow him. IPOB have never called for two days sit at home. Two, we have never. Only one. Once in a while. So all those people shouting it, if they will convince, they try to convince him. Nah, they should feel it in the canon. It is a lie. Those thing is what is keeping in the car. You know, gullibility have destroyed some people. In a go partner, hand a claim on a hammer. Oh, you know, na contract, my own arrow, my own, my little shark of the gate in the body order. If not, you ask yourself, why do men your fable told Mazichina Samuru to forget DOS, abandon DOS? I said DOS is a two people. To abandon DOS, what is DOS? Continental rest. Don't discuss with them. Don't discuss with the and the gun with them. Um, other heads, head of media, don't discuss with the gun with them. Every other heads in IPOB that are member of the Regulator of State. So they told him, we will now bring you one person, Simon, he will help you. Do you know what they want to do? They want to destroy the American. Had the Tina Samuel, Master Tina Samuel been dubious as they are, it was okay because they promised him to finance him. It was okay after I'm in charge, so let me abandon the US. They will, will now, as if you can send ESN to Abuja, DSS, to go and free Namikan. DSS, no. Then what is their target? To destroy IPOB leadership, which is the powerhouse of Namikan. 
where the government is afraid of. Immediately he abandoned the US, then followed them and said ESN will be used to free Namdekan. That's the end of Namdekan. Because that's why the Nigerian government, first of all, presented court to the world. Now, they were waiting for Nelly Ofebu and his gang to perfect their job well and make IPOB to say we are not going to court, we are going to use ESN and free our people. And you saw Nelly Ofebu working it, trying to work it out through China Samuel and promised to bring someone to help him. That someone will be doing the media one, you will be doing. But we have Radio Biafra. Do you now see the game? Now ask yourself, had we been using ESN in the matter? Will it not be kind of secure something you can present to any country in the world and say, this is our demand, obey court order? Can you? No. The court order that we secured did not was not secured because you did our own or you were violent. No, it's not. It was secured because IPOB maintained peaceful conduct, thereby creating strong ground for Namdekano's lawyers to argue boldly in court, knowing that the IPOB that Namdekano leads is still maintaining the same thing that they, the lawyers, are defending Namdekano on in the courts. Had we deviated, then you know we have disgraced the lawyers. They will come back shamelessly. They will have no option but to surrender because you cannot be controlled, because you are destroying their image. They are defending the constitution, defending the law, and the lawful agitation of Namdekan and IPOB. When you turn around and start using criminality, that is to say you want to disgrace the lawyers, but IPOB never fall in that. That's why the lawyers can defend Namdekan to any length, knowing that the people he's leading refuse to deviate, and thereby giving the lawyers great ground, boldness to speak out, and to defend the Namdekan. But with the criminality, the lawyers will go shamelessly. Do you understand? These are the ground we created. So Namdekan, all his victories came up because the activities of IPOB are being monitored when we deviated. But we will continue to separate criminals from activities of IPOB, which we know that IPOB can never be involved in criminality, and the Namdekan have never supported criminality, and he have been warning and be speaking against criminality, and we continue to maintain it, that criminality have nothing or no place in Biafra struggle. Criminality, whether championed by IPOB or any group, it doesn't matter your group, IPOB will fight your criminality. It does, you can't say you do your own. If you want to kill, kill yourself. You don't do your own to kill our people. It is not doing your own. Doing your own that will not affect our people. That's your doing your own. But if you say do your own, let them do your own. Why do you kill our people? Is killing our people doing your own? Then you are against what we are fighting because we are fighting for the freedom of our people. Thereby, our people must be saved, protected. So if you turn around killing our people, we say, why do you kill? He said, go and do your own. Leave time and I say, you are a fool. We must not go because you are killing our own. Now you see the argument. If you kill yourself, we will know that you kill yourself. We will not put them out. But you cannot be killing our people and we say, why do you kill our people? He said, he said, I told you. We ask you for what? He said, free Namdekan. We say, no. It is not what Namdekan gave us that for. And he said, you are envy. You don't want Namdekan to be free. Let them kill you first. Let us see if Namdekan will be free. The people you have killed, have you ever seen Namdekan come out from them? The KK you burnt, did Namdekan come out from them? The vehicles you burnt, did Namdekan come out from them? The okra you destroyed, did Namdekan come out from it? Then why do you tell us to allow you to do your own when it yields no fruit? Rather, agony, pain to our people. And also, facilitating the illegal um, continuous illegal detention of Namdekan, giving federal government grant. Right? And that is why we'll be exposing it. Dealing with it, it doesn't matter your group. You must leave this land if you are involved in criminality. We fight every general criminality. It doesn't matter if you like to use the Afra flag and so clothes. Hence, criminality is involved. It is highly prohibited. Whether Biafra struggle or not, you see this land, 
Criminality is highly prohibited. Talk more of the one you call on Namdekano to commit. You call on Namdekano, you say he's for free Namdekano. We said even ordinary armed robbery is not accepted. Talk more of committing you with the name of Namdekano. Are you, are you insane? Or the name of Biafra agitation. We said that you said do your own. Are, are you mad? Are you foolish? When you are killing our people, did the, the police station go sit at home? No. They are all in the station. Then why did you not go to police station and shut it down? Before shutting the markets down. Before coming to market to kill our people. Why did you not show us where you are shutting down police station? Why did you not show us where you were shutting down the police barrack? Where the children of police are, are living? No, but you show us where you were flogging our children. That the Namdekan is fighting for, IPOB is fighting for, ESN is fighting for. You lie them down, show them gone. They were traumatized. Both the teachers, you were showing them gone. The same gun they showed our children since 70 to 70. And they starved them to death. You complain about it. And you turn around this time, you started showing our children gone again. Putting them into trouble. You saw all their bodies shaking. You say it's a film that's why you lied them down, um, flogged them. Both teachers, you saw the teacher, you saw that you, those people were traumatized. The same thing that happened to our children, it's 7 to 7. You returned it back. You say you sit at home, we ask you, say film it is a lie. You are working for the enemy. Sit at home, this fake sit at home, we say no to it. And we continue to do so. Until criminality is destroyed in this land, because IPOB is whiter than white and whiter than snow. This is what we mean. We are against criminality. That is the whiter than white. We are against evil. And we'll fight it, irrespective of who is doing it. It doesn't matter your, your, your reason of committing crime in our land. We will expose it. Do you understand? And let us just touch, because I will do a short, short video for this one. What is happening in Aba? What is happening in Aba? Is what I want you to understand now. Let us go there. First of all, you will get the reason why it happened. Let us watch. Oh, I am market. International market is on fire. The motor police are my local. The police are my local. Then we police are Then I have international market. Then we not your. Then we to. Do you now see it? Now, this one happened on the 25th July 2023 in Aba at First Road, Aba, around Samek there. Right now, see the issue. These are escorts of politicians, escort of a commissioner, a new commissioner in Abia State under Labour Party. This is political action. These very security men were escorting this very politician. And you see the police, they cannot open this thing up. Now, because they always look for a way to come and kill us. They always, that's why they were deployed. Right? What they are practicing, I'll show you what they are practicing in Aba. That is that operation that the army, um, army chief declared. That very operation, it has started. They started in Aba. Now, let us move.
Who knows if they are PDP that are attack the convoy or sorry the escort, the police escort of this very commissioner in Abia. The commissioner escaped because that place is always tight. That very first road, that very that place, there is no chance for such. You can't move easily. So what they got was the um, escort. And now, today, when this day happened, 25th, people ran away. People closed their shop and ran. This very morning, on the 26th of July, Nigerian Army, Nigerian police, Nigerian SARS, all of them now police, both DSS, all of them, Indo Red also, military police, all of them arrived at Ariadne. First road, everywhere, Ariadne Junction, everywhere. Both in, inside town, Aba, that have nothing, not even closer to that place. Now, you ask yourself, why do they shut down markets? They close markets, and you, they did not go and look for the people, the attackers. They now turn against our people in Aba. Do you now see how they come in? Now, tomorrow now, this thing I'm telling you is political um, attack. It's a political attack in Aba. But the army have turned it against us to be using it against citizens. Because as far as Igbos are concerned, they have been hated by the Nigerian government. So kill them anytime. Kill them, even Flani. They told them that uh, we are their slaves. So they are right to kill us anytime, anywhere they see us. They have to kill us. Now, see the reason why the army came to kill our people. This is escort, police escort, escorting, escorting a commissioner. That commissioner escaped. And now they refuse to call that commissioner in Abia under a lawsuit. If they did not call, they should have to call the name of that commissioner that this escort was escorting. This police escort was escorting a commissioner. The commissioner they said that that commissioner, there is some illegalities that. PDP members have been using to defraud people in Abia State. This very commissioner came under a lawsuit and blocked everywhere those things that have been taken from people. And they have been monitoring this people. And we believe they have been monitoring this man. We believe that this is opposition attack. What they got was the security of the man and the escort of the man. The man escaped because that place is always somehow people that place that uh, first road is not always true to pass now they refuse to say it is political attack they turn it around to see it as a channel to kill our people do you understand what happened in Aba? they now deploy army and police to be killing us they break a shop where they are selling phone nigerian army pack all the phones in Aba. Pack all the phones. Nigerian police and army, they went into the street to start kidnapping people. Because politicians attacked fellow politi politicians and their escort was involved. Why did they not announce and make clear where these security men, if they are on, on official duty, what were they going to? What, where were they going to? Where, where, where did they move from? This security that was attacked, they were escorting a commissioner under a lawsuit in a bar, and that commissioner escaped. The, the, the opposition, opposition parties that attacked this very man, this very security, that man was not, they didn't get him, that commissioner. And they cannot announce the name of that commissioner so that they will clear the air that. People should not be involved in this thing. This is political attack. This is political. But they have shut up now.
They refuse to accept what happened. So that people will pay for it. Small time. All these criminal, criminal um, idiots in Finland. His criminal gang will say that it was water water that did it. Small time. All these people they are kidnapping in Abba now, Nigeria Army and police. They will not present them as IPOB ESN. Finish you see them. Because Simon and his gang, small time, this thing that they don't know how it happened. They will not come and claim it. Take the credit. But this is political attack. This is political attack in Abia. This is political attack. They should clear the air. They should stop calling this unknown government to use it and kill us. This political attack. The, the escort was escorting a commissioner in Abia. On the other side, the commissioner escaped. This very, this very escort, police escort, was spotted. And they set it on fire. They killed a policeman. This thing was not committed by other people. It was not committed by it. it. It is political attack. But before you know it, they will channel it to IPOB. And that is why we are here to expose. I'm going to know it. You want to catch me? I'm in Biafra land. But you see truth. Even the day you will kill me, if you are permitted by my God, I will keep saying the truth in your face. In your face. Whether you are idiot, I mean, I will say the truth in your face before you kill me. Good again, then. Let us go. Now, we need to go and see what now happened. Now, listen, this is Ariana Johnson. Ariana Johnson. Nigeria Army. Nigeria Army, no bread. Oh, I mean, no bread, no I mean. Do you understand? Now, this is after the political attack. This is what we are seeing. Now, see another one. Happen in our back today. They are here for one name. They are in the church. Seeing the heart in a hilos. Now, he's now flogging them. You see how you'll be flogging people they caught. Police. Or what? See? They are beating them. You see? You see? He's now beating our people. Is them beating our people in their hilos? They are not the people that attack police, so. Listen, just watch. See. 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 See um, our people, their friends, are in that vehicle. See them. See, he's now flogging them. Upon that in the hill also, you don't even know if they have shot them. He's still flogging them. These are not the criminals, so do you understand that Nigerian government knows what they are doing? Then see another one happening in Naba. I'll still come to Enugu if I have chance. Then let me go somewhere and get another one happening in Naba. Is it a first crime? <laughs> we will expose it to We will expose crime in our land though. It doesn't matter how you feel. It doesn't matter how you feel. Play now. This time they don't show. For Eli and this one. Try this way, put it out. Eli, play on your cages. And I put this voice now, you don't know. See? Nigeria Army. Police. Killing our people. Child. Child. You see? See the torture. On our people. No market in our in our area. No market today because um there was political there was failed political assassination. Failed political assassination in our. There is a one that we are breaking shots. Want to get it? Want to get it because these things need to be shown. Okay. What is that? Oh, 
still short, so go, okay, can okay, break step. That one is going up. Come down from the house. After criminal have attacked police escort. After criminal attack police escort. This is what about his faces. You see what we are facing. These are not these are not the criminals. They are, you see how they are breaking house. We told you that these are terrorists. These are terrorists. Their duty is to instigate trouble in our place and use that opportunity to start killing us. These are terrorists. Watch again. <laughs> Come down. Oh, we are Oh, we are charging mad. You don't steal each other. I'm a don't steal each other. You see what we are facing? You see? This thing, they would have done all these things since. And I will be going to Armstrong. But we said no. You see, they are frustrated. The same time here, everywhere is peaceful. Now you see, now they want to create a ground in Aba. Now, that's why they are setting up this. So that they want to help and enforce the sit at home. That's what Nigerian Army and Police is planning now. Do you understand? They want to enforce it. Now they want to bring fear in Aba. You know the month have ended. So they want to, they always promote evil against Aba. But if I tell you for sit at home, you will see commissioner of police giving press release. Only a day, you will see governor giving press release. You will see IG of police giving press release. You will see army chief giving press release. Again, sit at home of IPOB. You will see even a two division giving press release. Do you understand? But this very fake sit at home, Nigerian government promotes it. Their media will announce it. Their media will promote it. But IPOB own. They will all give press release against it. Now you see the difference. Now you see what is happening now. We are just waiting for them to tell us the truth. They cannot say the truth. Because if they say that this is political attack, you know, uh -huh, uh -huh, that is a, you know, they, they will not have ground to break people's shop, to steal people's phones from their shops, to we kill people anyhow, as um, um, Peter and Ba have killed in Enugu. Adam Akwama, Peter and Ba have killed in Enugu. You know, I would have had a labor at the Bebot and hence the IFO. They are now committing crime by themselves. Only plan they will lay a foundation on the area. And that's why we tell you anything fraud, anything criminality will be at the by POB. We say no to criminality. Both police, both army, we condemn it. Any criminality of any kind. And that is what we are telling our people. And we will continue to do so. Thank you, Muchineke. Our leader must be freed. Not in a criminal manner. He's not a thief. And the Afra will be restored. Thank you. I remain the fellas I do be evangelist. I am not up here. Thank you, Muchineke.